Welcome to Mobile World Congress 2024 here in the heart of Barcelona. I'm here at the regular venue, the FIRA. We were here last year. Tech Today brought you the latest and greatest in tech in 2023. And the conversation and the buzzword then was about AI. But it's no longer a buzzword because people are walking the talk. All brands are talking about AI, IoT, a connected ecosystem. And it's not just about product innovation or a service that they're offering. There's also conversations about regulation. A lot of people here from the EU regulatory policy space talking about what kind of safeguards are needed in the world of AI. Qualcomm and MediaTek, the major chipset manufacturers, are talking about an AI ecosystem where you can do so much offline as well on your devices. The guys who've done this already, and we brought you a lot from Galaxy Unpacked, Samsung Galaxy AI is a huge demo here at the Mobile World Congress. Then they're also launching the Galaxy Ring, which in India will be interesting if it does launch because it's not just health and fitness tracking, it's also payments. That could be a game changer in the UPI era that we live in. Lenovo and Motorola yet again give us a showstopper in the form of their two concepts. One was the transparent display, which was mind-boggling, but I'm not quite sure how that would really translate into reality. And the other one was the adaptive display, which we saw at the Lenovo World event, where they had this adaptive display like a wristwatch bending on your hand with several battery sensors like a vertebral column. A lot of innovation happening at that one booth, and we have gotten you those on Tech Today's pages, across platforms, on the Tech Today website, on the TV show, and of course, on digital as well. There's a lot happening in the Xiaomi world of things. They finally got their Xiaomi 14 series. That's a big launch for them, but they also have the Xiaomi SU7, the big EV that we're all expecting. Not much of a hands-on, but we're gonna try getting you the most about that. That's not gonna be launched in India either. HMD has a bunch of launches as well. Honor with a big focus on artificial intelligence, but that's a brand that's still coming up in India, but a big presence here. Huawei as well at the Mobile World Congress. Lacks of visitors, attendees, as you can see, forever blowing bubbles behind me, but that's what the Mobile World Congress is all about. The stuff you see on camera, and then all the closed door meetings and the big conversations that happen off camera. You'll see them all on Tech Today. I'm your host, Ayush Alabadi. Stay tuned to our platforms.